All right, guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a contingency in 2025 on Facebook ADS. It also works for Google ADS. Here are some tips that I'm going to share with you. If you're dealing with blocks, still getting blocked, and you're tired of it, unable to scale your accounts, watch this video because it's going to help you, all right? This is a lesson that I guarantee you. Many people selling Facebook ADS courses don't have a lesson like this one on contingency. So go ahead and subscribe. Leave a like because the content that's coming up here besides being free is awesome, all right? So let's go contingency 2025. What do you need to have first? A profile that's at least six months old. Facebook knows if you create the new profile after being blocked. If you created a new profile, Facebook recognizes that, all right, he knows the profile was created recently. So this generates a much faster block. What I recommend is to have a profile that is at least six months old. You can ask someone if they want to provide one for you, but if you don't have one, can't get one or don't know what to do. We have profiles for sale. The link is right here in the video description. All right. What is it? I'm going to ask the editor to put that on the screen as well. But a profile that's at least six months old, you just need to add your card and you can start advertising again. What you also need is a multi-login. I use Dolphin. Why do you need to have a multi-login? To have multiple profiles on your machine without getting blocked, Dolphin allows you to have up to 10 profiles for free. In other words, you won't pay anything to use it, to test it. If you have more than 10 profiles, it's because you're already scheduled there. Paying won't be a problem, all right? Well, this is the Dolphin screen, all right? Here you can have multiple profiles. I've already made a more detailed video about Dolphin. I'm going to leave it in the description of the video. You come here to create a profile, put your profile here. Use the proxy, which is what I'm going to talk about here. If you need to, you need to use the next one. Here's a tip for you, all right? And I also got a 20% discount coupon. The links are here in the video description. Then. You take a look over there. All right, so guys, going back to the DOF, it won't let you get blocked due to data crossover. Then there are people who ask me, Ramon, I only use one profile. Do I need to use Dolphin? The answer is this. If your PC, if you've never been blocked and you don't have a problem with that, you don't need to use it, all right? We're not going to go now. Here's the thing. If you've been trying to advertise for a while, you already have there. If you've already tried to create a profile, you've already been blocked, you've done a bunch of things on your machine, and that probably Facebook will know and will flag it. It's recommended to use Dolphin. And that brings us to the next point here, which is the use of proxy. It's worth it. Just, oh, do I need to use it or not? My answer is this. If you, as I said, are not having any blocking issues, you're good, then you're not getting blocked. You're using the browser. You already have several profiles on your machine. You haven't been blocked. Guys, you don't need to worry about proxy, all right? I sell proxy. I could easily come here and tell you, no, buy proxy because it's good. It's this and that. But here we work with the truth. If you're not getting blocked, you're good. You don't need a proxy, all right? Understand this. You don't need to... Now, here's the thing. If you're getting blocked a lot, you've already created a profile. You've set up a new page, changed creatives, switched cards, and man, you don't know what else to do. Your email has already been changed. You've done everything and you're still getting blocked and not able to advertise. Use a proxy because it's very likely that your internet and your PC are flagged. So I'm going to leave the link here in the video description to our website as well. Proxy is the best option to avoid issues on Facebook. It's dark, cool. Dark, yeah. It's the best proxy there is, which we use there, and we'll give you a discount coupon too that I'm going to leave here in the video description. So just let it go. Use the proxy. You're going to link the proxy here in Dolphin or another browser, whichever you use, but we use it in Dolphin and it works really well. So there's a video on how to use it, how to set it up, and it's also in the channel description, but it's pretty straightforward. Come here to edit new proxy. Put the proxy here and it will start running. It will show up here. All right, so... Use a proxy if you're getting blocked a lot. You feel like your machine is flagged. All right, all right, let's go. Guys, one more thing. So you've sorted that part out. Now you're using multi-login, you're using the proxy, but what you can't do is try to do too many things at once. That's right. So let's say you set up the proxy in Dolphin, you created a profile or you bought one from us. You linked it there and now you're anxious. You want to advertise, you want to create a page, you want to add creatives, you want to put in the card. Facebook is going to identify that pattern and block you. All right. So do things, for example, are you going to announce now? You put your credit card in a few hours. Create the page, set up the ad account, and link the card before messing with the campaign. Doing everything at once can lead to Facebook blocking you. You already log into the profile, create the page, set up the ad account, link the card, verify the business manager, then people want to do everything at once. This creates common activity and Facebook blocks you, okay? So take things slowly. Take a day to create the page, add the credit card, create and link the pixel. The profile on your machine is normal. Do it little by little so Facebook can see what it is. And this profile that's on your machine, it's a normal profile. It's a normal user who is accessing there and doing things normally. Now you logged into your profile on the first day on the machine with the proxy and started doing a lot of things. The chance of you getting blocked is high. Okay, it's not 100% certain, but trust me, the headache is